Pokemon. The main franchise has been going on for more than 15 years now. It hasn't changed one bit. With the games, they've evolved in many different ways with new evolutions per generation. But now they're taking it way too freaking far! Seriously. I'm sure, I'm sure if you subscribe to anyone who does Pokemon, they've already reviewed this. The Mega Form. Okay, let's start off with saying, the Mega Form clearly is just a new habit of Pokemon making money. I don't blame them, but still, I wish that this thing would exist back then when Emerald came out. It's because that was clearly one of the best generations, and people would actually like this. Because they, they would like a little oomph to their favorite Pokemon. Like, this Abzal looks awesome, to say the least. But it's a bit too late after seeing the cure and what works and how outgoing it was and pushing the boundaries. It looks a bit bland. And of course, you know my shiny Lucario, which I had since Diamond and Pearl. He has to evolve now. Great. That's what I needed. Also, Ampharos just seems way out of place, and Mawile just seems way too dangerous and very unlikely to use. Anyway, because in the show, it'll be like this evil monster. Oh, wait. That's Pokemon. And Mewtwo, it was revealed that it, they changed form, so now it's a mega form? Then why don't you just make Kyurem's mega form? I don't get why Pokemon would do such a stunt like this. And the main thing that annoys me about this is because Ampharos and Blaziken are both stage 3. I understand how this looks better than that, and how this looks better than that, decently better. But still, we should have done this before, and I don't like that they're doing it now. Blaziken does not deserve to be a stage 1. It deserves to be a stage 2, just in case they were thinking of knocking off some stages. Oh, come on. But, this might be due to some stones, so it might be by choice. But hopefully Lucario is as powerful as it is without Megaform or with Megaform. Because, if it's not, then that's literally a waste of freaking time. So, that's basically what I have to say about Megaform. And also, we have two, we have three more Pokemon leaks. But the one thing that I would like to say about Megaform is that I this came out of the blue. I wouldn't even think about this after all the years I've been in Pokemon. It's literally something that would not happen. Usually. Now, it shows all the Pokemon when it's normal. These look like Pokemon. These don't. And Mewtwo looks like Martian freaking Boo. In the eyes of an angel. Freaking on for us. And what did they do with it? Why does it have a tusk? Or is it just hair wings? Oh god, so much bad stuff. The color looks awesome, by the way, but red, so much mixture of stuff. Ah, oh, too awesome. Uh, Blaziken, too much artwork, like Kyurem. Same thing with Lucario. And Mawile, the head was cut off, but I know how it looks. It does not deserve to be that dangerous. Seriously. Well, that's my opinion, guys. Leave your opinions down in the description below, and maybe I'll review them later. And, basically, before I leave, I'd just like to thank you for 100 subs. And the 100 sub special will be coming pretty dang soon, so, um, hopefully you enjoy that. And, um, what was I going to say? Three new Pokemon are also coming out, which is a brat thing that looks like Pikachu. I don't remember the Japanese names of any of these Pokemon. Um. Then it's a bunny thing and a go go pre evolution, which looks like a goat. So basically, I don't have any idea what's going to happen, but hopefully, something special happens with the Mega Form. And usually, all Pokemon get this because it shouldn't be a limitation of only six Pokemon. And I like that the Pokemon Abzol and Marwell are getting an evolution, but what about the legendary uh, Pokemon? They're not supposed to evolve. That was all the confusion with Zorak, is he a legendary, is he a... Now, I could say Zor Zorak a legendary. The same thing could happen with Mewtwo, even though he actually is. Azul was considered a legendary until now. Well, people didn't consider him as a legendary, but he was in the, in the movie with a legendary brought on, so that still has something to do with it. Also, Ampharos has already two evolutions. Mary, and not to mention... The one, the only, Flaffy. So, that's on its own is weird. And the thing is, you're so annoyed. The Lucario is perfectly fine. You don't have to change it. 
Sometimes they're overdoing it. And Blaziken. Uh, what can I say about Blaziken? You're a freaking starter. God. And I understand they'll be using a stone and all that shiz, but I'm not probably not. I'm probably not going to use a mega form. I don't care if it like tops the format. I'm probably not. Or if it does like become way too OP, I might and crush all my friends. Anyway, guys, that is my opinion about main mega form. And I made an X and Y video a couple of weeks ago, but the thing is that it refused to upload to YouTube, and I deleted the video thinking that it did upload, but uh. <laughs> How stupid am I? So, everything that has been reviewed in all of the Pokemon X and Y thing is, was in that video. So, that stop sending messages saying, Oh, yeah, why didn't you, uh, why didn't you, why haven't you, uh, reviewed X and Y yet? It's because of that. I would do X and Y, but still, it takes time. It was a 30 minute video, I think. It's because I was like, it was in, um, July, so, I had to review everything, but, not doing that again, I'm tired. So, um, that's my opinion. Go ahead and leave a comment down below and let me know what you think about the mega forms of all these awesome Pokemon. 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 I'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye, life.